So the king and his queen watched with heavy hearts as their most precious possession, their only child, disappeared into the night. Many sad and lonely years passed by for King Stephen and his people. But as the time for the princess's 16th birthday drew near, the entire kingdom began to rejoice. For everyone knew that as long as Maleficent's domain, the Forbidden Mountains, thundered with her wrath and frustration, her evil prophecy had not yet been fulfilled. Are you sure you searched everywhere? Yep, yep, uh, uh, everywhere. We all did. Uh, 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 and what about the town, the forests, the mountains? Uh, we searched mountains, uh, uh, forests, and uh, houses, and uh, uh, let me see, uh, in all the cradles. Cradles? Uh, yep, yep, <laughs> every cradle. Cradle? Did you hear that, my pet? All these years, they've been looking for a baby. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Idiots! Imbeciles! Oh, they're hopeless. A disgrace to the forces of evil. Oh, my pet, you are my last hope. Circle far and wide. Search for a maid of 16 with hair of sunshine gold and lips red as the rose. Go, and do not fail me. 